When I first moved up around Fort Worth, Texas, I was living in a small town outside there called Stephenville. I was in a small bar and they had an open mic night where just anybody could come up and play a couple of songs. And it was a, an older fellow that came in and played a couple of songs. He had this big old beard and he was a veteran of the Vietnam War and he had these amazing songs he was playing. And it was right when I was really kind of starting to play the guitar and write songs and we hit it off and became friends. He invited me to come out to his little farmhouse. He lived outside of town and he had this old orange Harley just with flames on it and you know, had the hand shift, clutch, all that kickstart. And uh, he starts telling me the story about his bike and he said that after he got home from the war, he found the frame just in the middle of a field. You know, just weeds were growing up through it and he went and rebuilt it with all kinds of parts that he had found and I just begged him and begged him to ride it, you know, and he's like, no, I'd never ridden a bike, you know, at this point, I was probably about 18 years old, mainly the only kind of horsepower I'd been on, I had a saddle and four legs, you know, so he finally told me, he said, well, if you can get it started, I'll let you ride it. I was just a child, I knew I was afraid There was nothing to gain, I found the running the other way I had to stand my ground and keep the wolves at bay I really think about when I was really starting to write songs and it was you know, initially it was like just kind of getting stuff off my chest and it felt good and then it was fun because my friends started wanting to hear them and then it turned into becoming my identity in a way, you know, and it gave me a chance to get out of the trailer park, you know, and not work in the oil field the rest of my life or build fence on somebody else's ranch out in Texas, you know. But what do you have to say, really? You know, anybody can sing a song about drinking beer on their tailgate in the parking lot or whatever, but you know, do you have something that's meaningful and that can help somebody? If you can sit in a room with people from all over the place that may be so divided on all these different things, but you can kind of come together on, on something, then uh, to me it makes it all worth it. Coming around to save me from the fray. Had to stand my ground and keep the wolves at bay. Well, I knew somehow there would come a day when I stood my ground, kept the wolves at bay. Well, I knew somehow There will come a day So I stood my ground Kept the wolves at bay What drew me into playing music and the guitar as well as that kind of sense of getting out on the road and seeing the world, you know? And that, as I was talking about being from a, kind of a small place and, you know, wondering what it was like out there, I was like, I don't care how I get out there, whether it's on a motorcycle, a horse, a car, a hot rod, whatever, it's like, I'm as fast as I can go and as far away as I can go, and if I run down the road, I'll get myself a boat. You have to stand your ground and keep the wolves at bay. Somehow There will come the day When I stood my ground Kept the wolves at bay Well I knew somehow There will come the day So I stood my ground Kept the wolves at bay